نحمده و نسلی علی رسوله الكریم اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم رب شرح لی صدری و یسر لی امری و احلل اقدتم من لسانی یفقہ قولی و جعل لی وزیر من احلی اللہم فکہنا فی الدین رب زدنی علما اللہم انی اسألکا علما نافیاں رزقا طویبا و عملا متقبلا آمین سم آمین السلام علیکم و رحمت اللہ و برکاتہ ٹرانسلیشن سورة البقرة ورس 186 و اینڈ اذا وین سالکا سین حمزہ لام تو آسک تو میک کوئسچن اور تو انٹیروگیٹ سالکا دس از ا پرفیکٹ ورب فار دا تھرڈ پرسن ماسکولن سنگولر ہی آسکڈ کاپس پر کا از ا پروناؤن فار یو فار دا سیکنڈ پرسن ماسکولن سنگولر سا آلا کا ہی آسکڈ یو Now this is pointing towards Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam because Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala is talking to Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam or the reciter of Quran that when my people ask you Ibadi Ain Ba Dal Abd means the slave or the servant Ibad is the plural Ya here is a pronoun for the first person singular form. Ibadi, my slaves. Sa'alaka ibadi. He asked you, my slaves, anni, an, about, ya, me. Anni, about, me. Fa, inni. Fa, zabar, fa, so, thus or then inni indeed i now i is i've derived the translation of i from ya fa inni then indeed i qaribun qaf raba means close or near qaribun i am ever near very close اِذَا سَعَلَكَ عِبَادِ أَنِّي فَإِنِّي قَرِيبٌ And when he asked you, my slaves, about me, then indeed I am what? Very close or ever near. اُجِيبُ جِيم حَمْزَ بَا means to answer, to respond or to obey. To reciprocate. Ujibu. This is an imperative or imperfect form. And the alif at the start shows that it is for the first person. And it is the masculine singular form. Ujibu. I respond. I answer. I accept. Da'wata. Dal. Ain. Wow. Da'wa. Da'wa means to call, to make du'a, to invocate, to supplicate. Da'wa, invocation, du'a, supplication or call. I respond to the invocation, to the call, to the du'a or the supplication of whom? Ad-da'i. Da'i means the one who invokes, the one who calls, the one who makes du'a, the one who addresses, the one who supplicates. Ida, when, da'ani. Da'a is uh, again for the second person masculine singular. 
he invokes he supplicates he calls he addresses or he makes dua for nunzerni for me when he invoked when he make dua or supplicated to me so what do they need to do those people who are invocating who are making dua or supplicating what do they need to do fal yastajibu fa zabar fa means so thus or then the lam here is for stress or it is for an order for the third person masculine plural they should do what so or thus they should obey they should respond positively they should they should answer or they should accept my orders <coughs> they should obey they should respond positively whom li for me fal yastajibu li so or thus they should obey or respond positively for me wal yu'minu and they should believe they should have faith they should have belief be in me why should they do this la allahum so that they yarshudun ra shin dal rushd means guidance ya at the start makes it an imperfect verb and wow noon shows that it is for the third person masculine plural yarshuduna they are rightly guided verse number 157 ohilla halam lam ohilla means here it is a perfect verb in the passive form and it doesn't it means that it has been made lawful it has been announced to be permissible or halal lakum for all of you laylata siyami layla means night asyami of the fasting ohilla lakum lakum laylata siyami it has been made lawful it is it has been made permissible or halal for all of you night of the fasting what has been made halal arrafasu rafasa means to approach sexually or to make sexual advances or to have any type of physical relationship of intimacy between the husband and wife ila towards nisa ikum nisa yo kum yo women hunna this is a pronoun for the third person feminine plural hunna they are who hunna is the pronoun which is pointing towards nisa ikum your women they are libasun lakum libas lamba seen means to cover to wrap to hide to to wrap up libas means the clothing the garments or the dress which covers or wraps up libasul lakum a clothing any garments a dress lakum for you wa antum and you all are libasul lahunna libas a clothing a garment lahunna for them alim allah ain la mim to know or to have knowledge he knows who knows alim allah allah knew annakum that indeed kum 
यू ऑल कुन तुम यू ऑल वर तख्तानूना खौ हमजा नून मीन्स टू चीट टू डिसीव नॉट टू टू फेल टू बी ट्रस्ट वर्दी दिस इज एन इम परफेक्ट वर्ब फॉर द सेकेंड पर्सन मैस्क्यूल प्लूरल तख्तानूना यू ऑल डिसीव यू cheated anfusakum your cells your souls fataba so he turned in mercy so he accepted so he forgave alaikum upon all of you wa and rafa he forgave he pardoned ankum all of you fal ana so now so thus ba shiru hunna ba shin ra bashara actually refers to the skin and you know what human beings are also called bashar they are known as bashar in arabic because human beings are the beings who have a covering of skin on the body and the skin is a covering on which the emotions and the feelings they can be seen and the effects of the feelings can be seen you see because when a person is happy there is there is a glow there is a reddish radiance on the face when the person is sad or the person is tense then the color becomes pale or when the person is afraid or scared then there is paleness on the skin and when we feel cold there there are goose flesh on the skin so the condition and the feelings and the emotions can be seen on the skin so human beings are called bashar because they are covered by the skin on which the effects of the body can be seen so human beings are bashar and skin means bashara means the skin now here we are referring to bashir you bashiru hunna mubashirat means the skin to skin contact of the spouse of the husband and the wife when the husband and the wife they make skin to skin contact or they touch each other or they have a close physical relationship this is known as mubashirat so yubash bashiru hunna is basically an imperative verb for the second person uh, second person masculine plural that you do what so now you you can have or you make sexual physical relationship with them bashiru hunna you make skin to skin contact you touch them or you have a relationship physical relationship with hunna with them wabtahu ba ghain ya means to to explore or to seek or to search this is an imperative verb ordering the second person masculine plural you all seek you all look for or you all find ma what kataballah has written allah he has ordered or decreed allah lakum for all of you wa and kulu hamza kaf lam means to eat kulu is what it is an imperative verb for the second person masculine plural ordering to eat to consume and you all eat washrabu shin ra 
Ba Sharaba means to drink. Sharab, Mashrub, Sharib. They're all derived from this. Washrabu again is an ordering verb. It is an imperative verb ordering the second person masculine plural. You all drink. Kulu, you eat. Washrabu, and you drink. And when, till when do you eat and drink? Hatta until yata bayana. Bayanun becomes clear, vivid, evident. Yata bayana, it becomes clear. Lakum, for you. Al haitu. Haitu means thread. Al haitul abiyadu, the thread, the white. So, al khayt is the noun, abyas is the adjective. Al khaytul abyazu, the white thread. Minal from al khaytil aswadi, the black thread. Minal fajri, of al fajr. Fajr means the time of the dawn. Summa, then, atimu, tamimim, to complete. Atimu is an imperative verb. It is an ordering verb, ordering the second person masculine, plural. You all complete. Asiyama, the fast. The fast which you have started since the morning, since the dawn, you complete the fast ilalayli until or towards the night. And during the fast, what do you do? Wala tuba shiruhunna. And do not you have physical relationship? Do not you have or make sexual contact with whom? Hunna. With them. <coughs> Wa antum, and you are akifuna, ain kaf fa. Akafa means to cut off, to seclude, to stay away out of sheer and simple devotion. Akif is the person who devotedly out of devotion for worship stays away. Out of devotion, conviction, cuts off or secludes from the worldly activities and just limits himself in seclusion for worship. Akifun is the plural of Akif. Akifuna, the ones who devotedly stay for worship. The ones who seclude or cut off themselves in devotion for worshipping. Fil masajid, in the mosques. Masajid is the plural of masjid. And the root word is seem, jim, dal. To make sajda, to bow down. Masjid is the place or the time of making sajda or bowing down. Tilka, those hadudullah are the limits and the boundaries of Allah. What? What are the boundaries of Allah? That you do not have sexual contact with your wives or with your women when you are in itaqaf in the mosque. Tilka hadudullah, those are the limits and the boundaries of Allah. Fala, thus do not takrabuha. Qaf raba, close or near. Takrabu, this is an ordering verb, ordering the second, uh, second person masculine plural. Fala takrabu, thus or then do not go near or do not come near to ha it kazalika thus like this yubayyinullahu he makes clear 
who makes clear allah allah makes clear ayatihi his verses linnasi for the mankind for the people la'allahum so that they yattakuna they adopt taqwa they become god fearing or they safeguard themselves verse number 188 wala taqulu and do not you eat do not you consume amwalakum amwal is the plural of mal and mal means the wealth the riches wala taqulu amwalakum and do not you consume your wealth bainakum among or between you bil batili in or with batil is exactly the opposite or antagonist of haq batil means false illegal wrongfully done deeds or activities bil batili in the false or in the illegal way or manner watu dulu dal lam wow to present to offer to send or to give watu dulu and you all offer you all present as what as a bribe biha with it ilal huk kami towards the judges or towards the rulers and why do you present and why do you offer this bribe to the rulers or judges litakulu lamzeli so that takulu you consume you use fariqan a part a portion min from or of amwalin nasi the wealth of the people bil ismi with sin wa antum and you are ta'lamuna you all know you have knowledge so now i would just be repeating from verse number 186 to 188 so that you can um, catch up any of the words you've left off verse 186 wa and idha when sa'alaka he asked you ibadi my slaves anni about me fa inni so or thus indeed i qaribun ever near very close ujibu i answer i respond i accept da'wata invocation call doa addressing supplication of whom adai the one who invokes supplicates calls or makes doa eva when daani he invokes he calls or he supplicates or makes doa to me so what should he do fal yastajibu li so or thus he should obey he should respond positively he should answer li for me wal yu minu bi and he should have faith and he should believe in me why la allahum yarshudun so that 
दे यर शुदून दे आर राइटली गाइडेड वर्स नंबर वन एटी सेवन ओहिल्ला इट हैज बीन मेड हलाल परमिसबल ओ लॉफुल लकुम फॉर यू ऑल लई लतामी नाइट ऑफ द फास्टिंग अर्रफसु सेक्शुअल एडवांस सेक्शुअल अप्रोच इलाकुम टूवर्ड्स योर विमेन वाई इज इट सो हुन्ना लिबासुल्लाकुम्मा वाई इज दिस परमिशन ग्रांटेड वाई इज इट मेड हलाल रफस इज मेड हलाल फॉर द नाइट्स ऑफ रमदान वाई हुन्ना लिबासुल्लाकुम दे आर योर दे आर garments dresses or clothings for you all wa antum libasul lahunna and you all are clothings garments for them alim allah allah knew annakum that indeed you kuntum you all were tahtanuna you all deceived you all used to cheat anfusakum yourselves fataba alaykum so or thus he turned in mercy so or thus he accepted repentance alaykum upon you wa arfa ankum and he forgave he pardoned all of you fal ana so now bashiru hunna you all have skin to skin contact you all have physical relationship you all have sexual contact with them and you do what vattaru and you all seek you all find ma qatab allah what allah has written what allah has ordered or decreed lakum for you waqulu and you all eat and you all consume washrabu and you all drink hatta until yatabayyana it becomes clear it becomes highlighted lakum for you what becomes clear for you al khaytul abyazu the white thread min al khaytil aswadi from the black thread min al fajri of the dawn summa then atimmu siyama you complete and i forgot to mention that here the completion is in perfection and precision you all complete the fast ila layli until or towards the night wala tubashiru hunna and do not you have physical relationship or sexual contact with them wa antum and you all are akifuna fil masajid the ones who devotedly stay for worship the ones who in devotion seclude or cut off from the worldly activities for worship fil masajid in the mosque tilka hadudullah these are the limits of allah fala takrabuha thus do not come near to them do not go close to them kazalika like this yubayyinullahu he makes clear allah ayatihi his verses linnasi for the mankind la allahum so that yattakuna they adopt taqwa or they have piety 
verse number 188 wala taqulu a don't of quran something which is not permissible which is not which is prohibited wala taqulu and do not you all consume or eat amwalakum your wealth bainakum between or among you all bil batili in the false or in the illegal or wrongful manner and how is that what tudlu biha and you all offer and you all present with it ilal hukami towards the judges or towards the rulers or the leaders and why do you do that litakulu so that you all consume fariqan a part of min amwal nasi of the wealth of the people bil ismi with sin wa antum ta'lamun while all of you are ta'lamuna you all no sadaqallahul azim